I can't go back to yesterday because I was a different person then. Lewis Carroll said that about 150 years ago. I see too many people wanting to do the same old thing even when they're at a different stage in their careers or life. This creates a lot of internal conflict and tension. You know how to do it, but your present day self says, I don't want to. So how do you resolve this? Well, you need to make some decisions. I think plowing ahead with your new idea needs to pass through three gates before proceeding. Time, money, and happiness. And not necessarily in that order. Does your current self have the time to explore a new venture? Maybe it's starting a business, launching a new writing career, or some other passion. If so, squeeze in the extra time it would take into your day to at least explore it. You don't have to do everything all at once, just get started. Is your current money situation manageable? Even if you don't make any money from the new endeavor right away. If so, the same advice. Just get started. And now to your happiness. Some people think this isn't part of the equation. They can just tough it out, tough out anything. I've been there, they're wrong. At the end of the day, if you aren't moving towards something, anything that makes you happy, you're stunting your growth. How about you? Is your yesterday self still giving you instructions to today's you? Got that burning desire to give something a new go? If so, check those three boxes, time, money, and happiness. If they all come back with a green light, go for it. If it doesn't work out, you'll be no worse off for the effort so long as you use the guidelines I listed. When I've used these three gates, uh, the three gates test before making major changes, it always worked out well for me. I'm confident it will work out for you too. So here's your action item and mission should you decide to accept it. If or when you decide something new is in your future, go through the time, money, happiness test. I hope you pass. If you found this video helpful, please leave a comment below. By commenting, we can help each other go into new areas and be successful in our businesses and personal lives. Remember, one hand washes the other, and together they get clean. Thank you for watching. Have a rewarding week, and I'll see you next time.